Hey everyone, this is a quick tutorial on how to uh, set the metronome in Logic Express 9. Um, <clears throat> down here the metronome controls, right now it's set on 120. Uh, if I want to hear it count off in the beginning of a recording, I would click on this. And then you're going to hear the click. Well, I love this and just press play. I'm going to hear the click. Now, if you don't want that accent on the four, if the accent messes you up, you click over here and you can click zero, I believe. No, it goes to one. So, anyways, one. It's actually now because I did that in the middle of this track, uh, it went to one four time all the way through. Um, what I can do is bring the cursor back and then set it again so the whole thing goes to one, enter, and now you won't have an accent. It just will go all the way through. Um, if you want to change uh, how many how many beats or uh, the denominator, you go here and go to 8. Now, it's, now if I hit enter, it's going to do that from where the cursor is all the way this way. So we don't want to do that. Um, we'll bring the cursor back to 1. And then if you press 8, Put eight in there. I'm left clicking on that twice and then that opens it up. Now it's all set in eight. <clears throat> and now with the click going, if you were to go and start a new audio track, uh, you go to here, um, new. If it's an audio track, click audio and create. Now if I hit record, it's obviously going to record my microphone. I don't have anything plugged in. But if I set the cursor here to record right there, uh, and I hit record, it's going to do a four count record. Because I already have it set in the uh, settings, the metronome for recording uh, got uh, I'm screwing this up a little bit, sorry about that um, we go over to preferences um, and you go into uh, audio I believe it's audio general oh metronome okay metronome recording count in sorry about that everyone um, count in so that would be settings metronome recording count in one bar or if you want to change that you two bars, three bars, four bars, whatever. Um, click on that and it'll do that. Um, and then the other thing, if you want to change the tempo, and if you have a, a MIDI track already written, the MIDI track will adjust automatically to your tempo. So if I say uh, 150, enter, uh, and, then, and then I'll unmute the track I believe you can do that while it's playing. So if you want to change it to 180, enter. Change it again. You can also drag it up or down by left clicking.
that's it and I got it looped so it just loops that measure I have the other two two tracks muted um, if I was take that mute off I could take it off or the the loop I can take it off by doing this or I can take it off by clicking on the green that's it